Previously on Kata Zero to a Handle, we finally started doing dungeons and grinded all the way up to Kata level 34. Now with a Hyperion in my hand and a Storm set for protection, it's just a matter of time until that handle is ours. It's your boy Chips Hawaii and welcome back guys to episode number 3 of Catacomb Zero to a handle. Guys, we finished last episode being pretty good at that floor seven grind, and today we're gonna get even better. We're gonna continue to improve in skill, speed, and quality of items. So one item I'm gonna be looking to upgrade is my pickaxe. Right now I'm rocking a stonk. Now a stonk has efficiency six and grants 130 extra mining speed, but I could also get an efficiency 10 golden pickaxe, which would grant even more mining speed and allow me to do even more cheeses while in dungeons. Unfortunately, Unfortunately, I don't see any efficiency 10 pickaxes on the AH right now, so we're just gonna have to go ahead and buy some Silexes. They are quite expensive though, so if we see any that drop below 20 mil or something like that, we're gonna go ahead and grab it up. Silex increases the efficiency enchant by one level, so we'll need five of these in order to increase an efficiency five golden pickaxe to efficiency 10. But one thing that we can do right now is upgrade our boots. As we are just about to hit Catacombs level 35, which is nuts progress, but as we're about to hit level 35, we can go ahead and upgrade from Necron's boots to some Maxor gear. And I know I can upgrade the pair that I'm wearing right now, but I kind of want to have both sets just because why not? So let's go ahead and look for a decent pair here. Now I think Ancient or Necrotic should be just fine, but since we have Necrotic on our current set, let's go for Ancient instead. And there is, where is it? This pair right here, that's five star Wisdom 5, Ancient bonus, and it is recommed for 22 million coins. I think we might just go for it like so. Boom. We do lose out on a decent bit of mana because it's ancient, but I think we should be all right. These new boots are going to give us a ton more speed, which is going to help with clearing. Faster clearing means faster runs, means more chances at dropping that handle. Speaking of chances to drop that handle, we ended off last episode at 250 runs, so let's just keep it going from there, boys. Dude, I really am just so much quicker with these boots, man. This is awesome. And of course, as I increase my cattle level, I'll go for max or pants, chest plate, and uh, be even faster. The pad goat. Oh, yeah, baby. Maybe? I think I'm on T. I think I'm on T this round. So nice. I don't even have to spam this rogue sword that much because the boots give so much speed. Hell yeah. Oh yeah. Let me slap you, Leva. So my first bunch of runs after 250 did not go so hot. I was on a massive dry streak until finally this happened. Nice, man. Finally a good drop. It's been such a long dry streak. And honestly, I don't even know if you can call an OFA good anymore. But this next drop is definitely solid. It's a beautiful weather chest plate that we can grab and make money off of. Come on, man. This is like one of my last chances to get a handle before run 300. We got to recom. You know what? I'm not even going to reroll. At this point, I'm just going to take it. Something I've been practicing as well as I increase my skill is ghost stonking as well as getting into dungeons before they begin. I really am getting quite insane at these rooms, though. I can't lie, dude. We got uh, chest number one. Thank you, bad line, for chest number two. And then just off to the side and up for the third. Now, moving forward to these next bunch of runs, I started off with, again, another wither chest plate, which is just crazy. Ho, oh, ho, ho, baby. Let's go. Slurp that boy on up. After that, the RNG Jesus drops weren't really coming, but I was still making decent profit because a lot of the time I would have two chests with two to 300k profit each, and that's definitely worth a dungeon chest key. But I gotta say, throughout this process here, the vibes would be super high at some points. It feels good while doing these dungeons, though, because I hop on sometimes, hit the AH, and straight up just have 80 million coins to claim, bro. Oh my gosh. And super low at other points. Guys, um, you know, hope is slowly, slowly dwindling down. I'm in this party right now, and uh, basically Ice Wolf was saying 824 runs, no handle, right? You know? I'm almost at 400 runs. Loopy's at over 800 runs as well. Player MC's at 100 runs. And Ren is at 630 runs. This is like over 2,000 runs and no handle in the whole party. It's looking rough, dude. It's looking rough. But I kept getting profit sometimes. And even when I didn't, I kept pushing on through to get those runs up and continue to get a chance at that stick that we wanted so badly. 
guys, 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 the fact that we are already on run number 400 is absolutely insane. Like, I know I haven't given you guys an update in a little while, but dude, oh my gosh. We are honestly absolutely flying through these things, and I'm having a good time doing it as well. The one biggest issue is these dang kismets, man. Somebody already called Love Crystal, but let's see if we can beat him to it. Yes, sir. Absolutely snagged. But guys, like, if I'm at 400 runs and i get a handle no and i'm using a kismet every single time it's uh it's not good it's not good the amount of money i'm losing i've already dumped at least 250 million coins worth into these feathers and that's just ridiculous if we go for much longer without getting a handle it's like not even going to be profit but let's get our mind off that real quick and go for some more upgrades taking a quick stop in the essence shop we are up to about 17,000 undead essence and i really want this next boss luck upgrade but i don't think 100k undead essence is really feasible right now so let's just go ahead and spend what we got first off let's go for some of these cheaper ones we can get you know health essence one defense one strength one they're super cheap so why not just grab them all and then as i am a mage we'll go a little bit more on intelligence now we're down to just 2k left and we can keep saving up there but in the wither essence shop i think we should put a little bit more on the blessings because they can just be a massive help so this right there gets me all the way to max forbidden blessings let's go an extra 10 percent you love to see it but hey back to the runs boys and even though I didn't max out my boss luck, in the next few hours, it really seemed like I did. Hey. Did you get the stick? Chest um, plate or chest plate or I did not get a stick. But it's better than an OFA. Okay, okay so chest plate. Let's go. Let's go. I think it's it's already. Yeah, we're going to. Torque for handle. Something. Oh! Did handle? No. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. I got leggings. I just had like a massive adrenaline rush. Like, wait, so we got handle? Yeah, I was like, oh my god, no way. I tell immediately that I got a chest plate. Guys, that was like my second chest plate in the past two hours. No handle, but my luck is going pretty well. We getting some drops out here. We getting some drops. And the luck just kept going. Oh my god. No way. No, no. Oh my god. Seriously? Dude, oh my you god. Got it. You got it? Dude, oh my god. No way. No way. Oh my god. Let's go. <laughs> no oh way. Let's go. It's over. It's over. It's all god. over, dude. No Bye. shot. It's over. Oh I'm my god. god. Oh my god. Bro, this run was so scuffed. It was so scuffed. A nine minute run, dude. <laughs> nine minute run nine. Let's no go. way oh my god no dude my heart right now <laughs> i know I, the feeling is good that's when i brought my giant sword it's like the same feeling dude oh my god let's go dude that's, the pain? that's insane Oh my god. <laughs> just, just hear the, the no way. No way. <laughs> I, thought you were, I thought you were joking at first, but you just didn't stop. Yeah, I thought you were joking too. I was like, what? It just didn't stop. I was like, no. Dude. Seriously? <laughs> I was not expecting that at all. That Me neither. So... Oh my god. Dude. Let's go. Oh man, how many runs am I at? 441. 441 runs, kismet every time. You, we so did you've it. Basically done a thousand runs. Four. He's an 881 or 882. 882. Runs. Yeah. Jesus, dude. Let's go. See, <sighs> that's why you reroll. <laughs> I didn't even reroll that one. But I have reroll. Oh, you all didn't? Past. No, that was just first oh. one. Dude, oh my God, that is so hard. He instantly hey. started started saying no way. <laughs> I was yeah. We were all like no way. And then, like, you didn't stop going, like, oh, my God. And I was like, oh, my God. Dude, right. fucking happened. GG. And, of course, no 900 million coin item can be obtained without the celebration of a guild party in the hub. Come on, now. Now double tap Q. <laughs> yeah. <imagine>. yeah. <laughs> it's now the next day, and I still can't believe we actually got the handle. Now, about 440 runs, I don't think that's super lucky. I don't think it's super unlucky because... 
I was using Kismets most of the time. Of course, there were those times where runs were thrown and we got an S instead of an S+, plus, and so I couldn't use a Kismet, but I definitely got at least 800 chances, and it led to this guy right here. Now, since I do already have a hype, we are going to sell the handle, and it kind of sucks because, like, a week ago, these things were going for, like, 980 mil cheapest, and now the cheapest is 860 mil. Still a ridiculous amount of money, though, so let's go ahead and put ours up for 859 million coins. I don't even know if this is going to sell. We're probably going to get undercut, but there it is. Anyway, as we are on a roll recently with dungeons, I kind of want to keep going. We've got a few more kismets left, so we might as well use those. And at that point, we're going to be getting pretty close to 500 runs, so we might as well get there as well. And let's just see what happens as we do. Two handles in one video. Who knows, man? Who knows? It totally could happen. Probably won't, but totally could. Floor 7 runs, here I come. And I did just that, man. Hopped back into floor 7 runs, even doing some carries with Serite. Continued making profit during the carries, as well as in some other runs. I got a recom. I'll take it. Oh, I got two recoms. And then here it was, my one chance to get a second handle in the video, and it was stolen. No shot, bro. Another homie in my party just got a handle, man. Oh my god. E -E talk GG, man. GG. But that's all good, though, because we did still get another dope drop. Nice, dude. Let's go, a chest plate. And here we are, guys, for the 500th time hopping down into the final phase of the Necron fight. Scare it off to the middle, Bonzo on over, and smack that boy. Oh my gosh. Final reroll of the video. How sick would it have been if we got a handle right there? Unfortunately, not even profit. Back here, we got 200k. I'll take it, guys. Oh my gosh, though. If we check our boss collections, it's over 500 kills on Necron and a beautiful pair of Wither Leggings to collect here. Very nice. At this point, we can also head back to the hub and collect everything on our auction house. We had to lower the handle to 845 mil, but still absolutely insane profit right there. And we've got a bunch of other goodies. So let's just hit claim all and wow. Our purse just jumped like crazy. <laughs> Let's go, boys. Let's freaking go. While I've been going through these dungeons, something has been kind of going on in the background, which is my bestiary. Since I was cat at zero, there was a whole category in the bestiary that was completely empty. And now there's you know, a bunch of levels all over the place. And I've been able to grind this thing quite a bit. So much so that I have just hit bestiary milestone 50. I've unlocked 500 family tiers. And this is not like an insanely high bestiary milestone, but I'm pretty proud of it. So GG's, GG's. Now lads, that is going to do it for this episode and the whole entire series from Kata Zero to a handle. Taking a look back, we did so much in just three videos. We spent a billion coins. We dropped a handle and made a billion coins. We did over 500 floor seven runs. We hit bestiary milestone 50 and we made it all the way to catacombs level 36. And for all that, I think I deserve a like. So hit that button down below and be sure to subscribe because it doesn't end here. We've got another series coming soon. We've also got hella content coming out with an update soon. So you guys don't want to miss out, but that is going to do it for today. I love you all and I'll see you all in the next one. Adios and goodbye.